Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dandy dong. Dandy dong ding dang. Hey, everybody. Well, let's get our ritual happening here. How's everybody doing? Oh, what a week. What a week. How was everybody's week? There we are. Shabango. And there is Buck and Billy Ray. He's probably got his... Drew Grob. Drew, how are you? Hang on one sec, friends. Man, oh man. So I'm outside. Sorry, friends. I'm outside and I'm listening to this. It sounds like a symphony. Hi, Derek LaFowl. How are you, buddy? Who's this? Oh, it's Maka. Oh, Maka, I was just thinking about you this morning, buddy. How are you? Maka, thanks for the super chat, buddy. Holy cow. Eric Long, good to see you. Uh... Anyway, friends, I'm outside eh? and I'm, I'm hearing, you know what I'm hearing? The birds. The birds are like, freaking spring is here, friends. It's here. Oh, I'm so happy. Maka, what a guy you are. Pilk Paul, good to see you. Alan, hi from Northern Wisconsin. Alan Kusher, Kushner. Maka. Christopher. Hey, Christopher. How are you, Christopher? Christopher Finesse. Christopher, um, did you see your axe in the video? I used your axe, or I don't think I put it up yet. It's the next one coming up, I think. Yeah, I took it out and smacked this big, great, big, huge round. Andrew James. AJ. AJK Axes. Hey, good to see you, buddy. Wooly's Wooly, good to see you. Hello, Bucking. KKDD. Wish you the best. Kim Watson, good to see you. Zach Corey. Hey, Bucking from Nova Scotia. Healed Heart, good to see you. No, no news on the Merc. Uh, the only news I got was the sound of the motor on, a, on an audio file. So it's fired up. It's running. I think they're just putting some, some fine stuff together, maybe some brake adjustments. Uh, no, and Ryan, he's probably cleaning it up for me and, uh, wants to present it to me on a platter. So he's that kind of a guy. Snowman, how are you? Tasman, Christine. Megan Hickey, good to see you, Megan. Hey, Meg. <laughs> it's Megan. It's Megan Hickey. Good to see you, Meg. Where's that Josh character? Bearded Jerky. Whoa. Michael and Julie, nice to see you guys. Mike Y from Ireland. Ah, brother. 
Hey, oh, there's the dusty dirt road. Ho, ho, ho. Dirt road, you son of a gun. Thank you, brother. Dirt road, thank you. Oh, look at Chris here. Obajon. Chris, with a super chat. Chris says, hey, Buckin, I ordered the shirt version of the hoodie. Are wearing the Acts of Kindness stickers. Nice. Thanks, brother. Look at Dirt Road, friends. Doesn't say nothing. Just boom. Here you go, Buckin. Here's some money. <laughs> Dirt Road, I love you, buddy. Dirt Road, say hi to your dad for me, please. You know what I'm going to work on today, friends? I'm going to work on being a little quieter. What do you think of that? Does that sound better? Should I work on being a little bit quieter today? I'm usually pumped up and freaking out and going crazy. <clears throat> Excuse me. Mike Fleming, great to see you, buddy. Thanks for the super chat. Hello from Snowed In, Wyoming. Right on. Robert Colley, nice to see you. Silver Badge. Dad is doing fine. Thank you, Dirt Road. Great, that means a lot. Say hi to him for me, Dirt Road, please. Man after my own heart likes his wood. Doug Wheeler's cleaning the bench. Good man. Mark Wilcock. Mark, good to see you here, buddy. Hey, nice to see you. Checking in from PA, Dr. Shock, Mr. Longstaff, Mr. Richard Longstaffs. You don't need to work on anything, man. Just let it flow, he says to me. <laughs> Richard, I know, brother. I just, sometimes I get going. Is that Donnie Walker? I think I see Don Walker in here somewhere. Mr. Slinger, David Slinger, it's always nice to see you, brother. Dahoo Productions, Snowman. Thomas. No, we didn't do any of that. No, no clear coat. No. But mind you, I don't know what he's doing. To be honest with you. <laughs> oh, Josh. What a guy. Josh Josh Hickey says, Happy birthday, Matt Runge. Uh, sorry for his law t-shirt on me today. Love you, Bucking. Hey, Josh, thanks, buddy. Thanks for the support. Jolk it, jolk, it, jolk. There's jolk. Mr. Jolk. Jolk, how are you, bud, today? Love it. Get louder, he says to me, jolk. Jolk says, get louder. The Bradleys on Catbird Hill. This is for someone who wants to super chat but can't. Love and blessings to all, Lieutenant Bradley. You know what? Mr. Bradley, you, you got a freaking heart blasting right out of your chest, don't you? You're a good man, John Bradley. Thank you, buddy. Thanks for the super chat. <clears throat> Jeremiah Schaefer says, howdy, Bucking Army. Dragon's Pick, good to see you. Good afternoon, Adam. Adam, nice to see you. Healed heart again. Thank you for being here with us, Stefan Merrill. You're welcome. Thank you. Wow. Flip, flop, and flying through here pretty good. Love and kindness. Life in the 906. Good man. Oh, you know what we need to do? We need to do this, friends. We can't have this going on like this. We got to lighten up my life. You... You light up my life. You give me hope. <clears throat> wow. There. How's that? Limitless. Good to see ya. The weather's been nice on the island. Thanks for asking. A little rainy today, but not bad. The temperatures are coming up. Flowers are popping out of the ground. The trees are getting blossoms on it. Yeah, spring's coming. It's here.
Oh my goodness, look at this Maca character. It's time for another Bucking Maca t-shirt giveaway. Oh yeah. Yes, it is. And you know who's getting it? John Such. Johnny, it's your lucky day, brother. Maca just bought you a shirt. So Johnny Such, we love you. You were at Buckingstock. You're a heck of a man. Heart of gold. You're a kind man, John. John, I need you to email Christine. Maca, thank you so much for doing that. Maca just bought a shirt. For Johnny Such. What happened here? Wow. Yeah, Johnny, I just need you to uh, pop over to see Christine at Buck and Billy Ray. Yeah. Christine, do you want to put the uh, put the email up for him at buckandbillyray.com. It's Christine at buckandbillyray.com, Johnny. Hey, Corey. Hey, Buckin, you're a true inspiration. I hope you, I hope to and will live a happier, loving life. Much love from Corey and Rachel in Waverly, Nova Scotia. Corey, them some pretty nice words, brother. Corey, thank you. Corey and Rachel. Isn't that nice, friends? It's darn nice. Corey, thank you, buddy. Give Rachel a big hug for us, Corey. Is she with you right now, Corey? Rachel with you on Sunday? Give her a hug. <clears throat> Excuse me. I can't tag as I'm on my phone. I try to reply as best I can. Maka. Hey, Maka, I thought you were a, a moderator, Maka. Weren't you a moderator, Maka? I thought you were. There's Derek LaFalle, the lawn man. Hello, everyone. Greatest show on earth, the dirt road says. Oh, dirt road. Maka, only on the Facebook page, brother. Oh, I thought you were a moderator here, Maka. Well, you are now. You should have a blue wrench now. You just had the power given to you, Maka. Just boom, just like that. Bang! Power! Maybe you're not quite sure. Maybe, maybe I'm not explaining myself. Boom! 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 <clears throat> Maka has the power. Man, she's ripping. Snowman, Tim, we got, oh, we got John Duesenberry. Hey, Bucking, love watching you give me faith in the man, in the man. Faith in the man again. Josh, brother, don't lose faith. Don't lose faith, brother. And if something don't feel right that you're doing right now, freaking change it, brother. Change it to what makes sense and feels right in the heart. He comes to everyone differently, brother. He does. You just, you just do what feels right. It's got to feel good or it doesn't work. You know what I'm saying, brother? Josh, you keep the faith. There's uh, Caribou Mike. Caribou Mike, good to see you. Uh, you climbing soon, Bucking? Uh, fairly soon, I would think. I want to take that. Uh, I want to take that Mac back up. That old Mac. I got it nice and sharp. I didn't know what it was going to cut like. It looked like it was going to cut, but the rakers were high last time I had it out. Remember that old Mac and that balsam? I want to take it up again. I think it's going to cut. Heal heart, Porteous. Patrick, how are you? Stephen Letts. Hey there, Bucking. Stephen Letts, how are you, brother? Good to see you. Chris Weber. Boom, you're the best. <laughs> 
Wow. Maca, that looks better. Your name is blue now. I don't know what we were doing. What were we doing, Maca? I don't understand. From Portugal, Arujo, Eduardo. How are you, my friend? Good to see you. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. Friends, I got I got an axe I'm going to make. I've been having such a freaking good time. So, friends, get this. Get this. You, you know this bamboo stuff, right? Right? Did I show you this last time? Did I, did I show anybody this? Remember this bamboo? I, I, I'm seriously thinking about this being the handle for the, for the buck and for the wood bullet, friends. Right? Yeah. That's oak. Friends, at the end of the day, the next video coming up is me running the log splitter and splitting wood, you know, doing, doing what I do. And it was at the end of the day, I was freaking tired. I was walking all over wood. You know how I get, right? I freaking had took one last swing at a little half moon and I, I hit it on the inside of the ax, okay? It smashed it. I, I thought I broke it. I looked at it. Nothing. 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 <laughs> it's crazy. <clears throat> I love it. Anyway, so I'm making a handle. I'm making a, a hickory handle, okay? So they say, hickory. It is hickory. I bought it at a store, okay? And I'm I'm banging the, banging the axe head on. Well, I break the handle. I break it right there. So I glue and weld it, uh, <laughs> glue and weld it, doweled it, okay? I, I drill four holes, five actually, one, two, three, four, and five, right there, okay? So I've doweled it, dowel right through and glued it, okay? Now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna beat the snot out of this thing when I put an ax head on it. I've already got one picked out. We might even get to it today. It's been sitting about a half an hour. We're gonna see what happens. The glue's already freaking dry almost. So let's see what happens. But I'm going to try it. And, and if I beat it up crazy for, you know, whatever, a month or two, I might put it up for grabs to see who can, see who can try and break it. Glue is, glue is strong. Look at this, friends. Look at this sucker. Look at freaking that sunker. So I, I, what I done, friends, is I went to, hey, who's that? <clears throat> it's Indiana Doug says, thank, thanks for introducing me and others to so many awesome people. Killinger, Iron Horse, Bayou, Tin Man, and others. Thank you for, Indiana Doug, thank you for your support. Uh, you're welcome, I guess. I, I guess I did that, did I? 
I don't know. Well, you're welcome if I did. Thank you, Doug. What a guy. Uh, yeah. Uh, I I'm not going to put it on here. These, these deserve a, a heavier axe. Something like... <laughs> oh. Too bad that one's not straight. That's a son of a gun. Anyway, friends, I went down and looked at a, uh, a power hammer. <coughs> Excuse me. I went and looked at a power hammer. It was too beat up. Brad from Broad River Forge is, he's, he's almost finished the project he's on and then he's gonna be building our press, friends. This is happening. This is happening. I'm bringing the wood bullet to people. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. I, I, I'll never be able to keep up with all the orders unless I went really big with the with the company after I do my thing. I, I don't know. I, I don't really. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I, I have no control. Well, I do have control over that. But you know what I mean? Like we'll decide because uh, I'll never be able to keep up. I can't keep up. I haven't been able to keep up for years, actually one man, right? Happy Sunday. Alicia Cod. Thank you. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Say hi to Nick. You are one of the reasons I'm in forestry. Oh, cool. Gregory. Good man, Gregory. Good for you, buddy. Follow your dreams, brother. William Raymond Smith says dirt road landing. That is my full handle. That is my full handle right there. William Raymond Smith. And from William, you get Billy. From Ray, you get Ray Raymond. Or from Raymond, you get Ray. That's Billy Ray. And then from the power saw, you get Buckin. Yes, indeed. Michael. Good to see you. Can you? Oh, there's Freddie Payne. Freddie. Oh, whoa. Freddie, thanks, buddy. That's a big one. Freddie. Thank you for your support, buddy. Fred Payne. What a guy. Freddie's a good man. Wow, that's like an F way up there. You hear how high that is? Wow. What about this one? What does this one sound like? Let's see if it'll howl. No, I don't think so.
Pull, oh boy. Holy smokes. Billy Ray, my friend, your heart beat in a mix of splitting axe sounds like the, what are you crazy guy, Paul? McCullough, but is so full of sweetness and kindness that he can fill everybody you crossing with positive energy. Thank you, my friend. Paul, you're a heck of a man. You, you know, you just, you're comfortable in your skin, Paul. I know you are. You, you, you. You got a good heart, buddy. Thank you. Thanks for the nice words, pal. Jason. Jason Reese. Jason Reese. Jason Reese. Super chat on aisle five. Jason Reese. Aisle five. Super chat. Jay Daniels. Hammer fun for Buck and Billy Ray. Jay Daniels with a $50 super chat for the power hammer. He's got here power hammer. Hammer fund. Jay Daniels with a 50 spot. <laughs> Jay Daniels, thanks. We love you, brother. <laughs> hey, that's fun. Jay Daniels, thank you for the super chat, brother. Rig Piggy, a $4. Buddy, thank you for the super chats. Everybody, thank you all. That's crazy. I said that's crazy, 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 crazy. <laughs> Andrew Collins throws down a super chat, says, Timmy's on me, amigo. Uh-oh, there's me old buddy Gainsies. Gainsies. Gainsies popped in from the UK for a $50 hammer fund. He's dropped some money down for the hammer fund, for the blacksmith fund. It's, oh, it's Gainsies with the 50 spot. Here he comes in with a 50 spot for Gainsies. It's Gainsies with a 50 spot. Gainsies, we love you. Andrew Collins with a $6.99 hot chocolate on me ice cream. <laughs> Doug Wheeler. <laughs> wow! You guys, thank you all so much. There. <laughs> I got a little accent here. It's about a... Th oh, my goodness. Doug Wheeler, thank you. Gainsies, you're awesome. Oh, I told you that, didn't I? Chimney, buddy. <laughs> Healed heart. Ronnie Burke, oh, dear. Hey everyone, how you doing, Buck? And here's some hammer dough. You people. Ron, thank you, buddy. Thank you so much. This is crazy. What a help you people are. That old Brad there, he's gonna wait till you see what he's building us, friends. I was up at Bear Claws yesterday. I had a chat with him. I said, Bear Claw, we need 220 out at the barn. He's got 110 out there with a couple of lights hanging. As a matter of fact, I did a little video of the room we're going to use, friends. It's like an old barn with cedar and one window. It's really dark in there. You want dark for the forge, right? You do. It's pretty cool. Ronnie, thank you. Thank everybody for all your help. Chris Saunders, all the best from the East Coast. Right on. Thanks, buddy. Paul. You're welcome, Buck, and I love your videos. Paul Beckner. Thank you, Paul. Thank you very much. Need me a wood bullet. Lee Wilkinson. Yeah, it's, it's a coming. Oh, my goodness. Now, wait a minute here. Who's this lovely person? Ashley Umbers. Crack and pull shirt. Aha! Hope you're well, Bucking. Love you, mate. Ashley Ambers. Ashley, wow. Thank you so much. Holy cow. That's huge. 
You guys want to do a crack and pull shirt? I got a couple ideas for new shirts, friends. We're, we've been working on the artwork for some. Um, we got a couple in, in mind. Ashley, thank you. Wow. And there's crazy gainsies. Holy cow. Who's that? Rig pig. What? Rig, rig piggy. Rig piggy. What that's, you, did you just do that again? You, friends, did he just do that again? Rig piggy. Didn't he just do one a few minutes ago? What's going on? Daniel's son. Oh my goodness. Bucken, this is my favorite part of Sunday. Thanks for showing people how to be kind in a time people forget. Oh, wow. That's nice of you to say. Thank you. Well, I, I just... I, I'm not going to stop. I, I'm not going to stop. Mike K. Gullet plates. Make some gullet plates. Hey, wait a minute. Fre Fred. Hey, Buck, and hope you saw my earlier message about my son's birthday praying for special gift god bless you my friend hey uh was it in your last super chat freddy sometimes i gap out fred did you have it in your last message fred thank you so much when's his birthday freddy fred you don't have to super chat to ask me it's just hard to see as you know but I'm looking for your name right now, Fred. When's his birthday? Bruce and Robin. Are they here? Man, this chat goes whipping by. Fred, when's, when's your boy's birthday? Hey, Casterman. Hey, the Manleys are here. Yes. Howdy. Fred, did you go somewhere? I want to know. Oh, there's Nick Pixel TV. He's back. Friends, look at Nick. April 30th. Oh, okay. Okay, thank you. Yes, April 30th. I'm the seventh. Yeah. Fred Payne, you're a wonderful man. Thank you for the, for all the help. You know what? Uh, Brennan, I, I, I've been thinking, I've been tr trying to track down, um, a plaid shirt for this channel, for the for the store, a plaid with the sleeves cut off. I, I have been. And I may have to just get my own um, fabric. I don't know. Maybe Christine can, Christine doesn't have enough to do yet. Maybe we should throw some more stuff at her to do, eh, friends? <laughs> Becky Davis, good to see you. William DeBerry, Mike Fleming. Mike was born on the 10th of March. April 30th says Fred, okay, Freddie, excellent. Wow. I'm gonna keep this one going, Christian. It's working fine. I did a major repair on that stove. Chris Weber, whoa. Watching you two years ago when I was 58 inspired me to get back into tree work. And it saved my home from foreclosure. God bless you, Billy Ray. God bless you, Chris Weber. Thank you for the super chat, buddy. Healed Heart would like you 
you folks to hit the hit the like button. She just she told me just now. She said I'd like you people to hit the hit the like button. That's I'm just relaying the message, friends. Hit the freaking thumbs up, will you? <laughs> Hey, hey, Joe Fry, guitar guy. Hey, 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 Bucking, you are the real deal. Hey, Joe. Good to see you, Joe. Union Jack says, hey, Bucking, just want to thank you. I owe you more than a simple thank you for the impact you've had on me and my life. I appreciate you, brother. See, this is the stuff right here, friends, okay? Union Jack, I don't know what to say, but I'm so happy, buddy, that you're doing good. This this is all that matters to me is that people, listen, I, I'm not gonna go there right now, but most of you know that I've been in, I, I've been I've been this close. On on my job, yes, but before that, when I was I was running. That's all. That's, that's the only way I know how to put it. It was like I was running from life and responsibilities, and 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 it, it was hard to explain. I never tried to figure it out too much, but I was an escape artist, and I escaped through drugs and alcohol. I did, friends. I'm just telling you, I did. I I escaped. I was an escapee. I wasn't a brown bag guy. I didn't drink every day. That wasn't me. I just, it didn't matter. I could go two weeks. I could go a month. It didn't matter. But when I picked up, I could end up 500 miles from my house on a four-day bender. Broke. Not able to bring tears to my eyes because I know I'd done it myself. It, it, I, got, I, I got to the point where I was... <clears throat> so when I hear people come here and they say, uh, bucking, you know, not, not to say that that was what they were going through, but the fact that this channel is helping people in some way, I, I win. It's a win for me. That's all that matters. I don't care if you don't like power saws or trees or axes. That doesn't mean anything to me. Those are material things. What's important is in here and in here and out there and it all gets in line. You get in line. You ever heard that saying called get right with God or get right with you? Well, get right with both. Get right everything. Your head, your heart, and the big thing. Boom! Just get right with you. Get right with it. You, you got to, well, you don't got to do nothing. You'll reap the benefits of your own choices. I did, and they weren't pretty. So I've experienced both sides now, and that's why I have gratitude, friends. That's why I, I, I'm happy, and I, I, you could you could come right to my face now and call me every word in the book, and I would stare at you and chuckle. I would, and I would say, "Are, are you okay? What's bugging you?" Obviously, something's bugging you because anger is a secondary emotion. You look hurt, but what's what are you hurt? <laughs> Abandonment, maybe. <laughs> It's so much easier for men to say they're angry and act a tough guy than it is to say that our feelings are hurt or that we don't or that we feel insecure as a man or that we've been lying to ourselves and people for all these years and we don't actually know what that means but we pretend to because we don't want to get judged like we don't know what we're talking about. The human mind is a crazy thing. It's a self self-preservation system. We are a self-preservation system. That's what we are. But when you get vulnerable and let her down, baby, she's just like, woohoo! God made me just like I was supposed to be. <laughs> you get free. Freedom rolls in fast, real fast. Like I'm talking now. You want integrity? Stop the things that don't give you integrity. Start doing things that do. What do you want to talk about? Simple? Is that not simple? You don't have to figure out why you did all this stuff. Don't worry about it. You did it. You're sorry about it. Move on. You know, say you're sorry. Forgive yourself. Ask for forgiveness and start trucking. Unless you want to hold on to it for blame. 
and a reason to stay stuck and get attention, that works too. You can do that, but not many people are going to want to be around you because they're going to see through it because humans are smart people. That was a lot of ramble right there, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. It's a lot of ramble. I just like the real stuff, friends. I don't. Hmm. Hey, there's Jote. Oh, buddy, Jote. Becky Davis, my sweetheart. Becky, how's Bob? I'm on April 7th. Yeah, me too, buddy. Me too. James White says, thanks, I needed that here now. Good. Friends, I came to YouTube. I was like, I saw a guy. I was talking about this. And uh, this this guy was getting interviewed. I, I've told this story before. A guy was getting interviewed and he was a big YouTuber and they asked him, they said, how, how did you make it on, how do you make it on YouTube? Or how does a guy make it on YouTube? And his answer was very simple. It was, this is what he said. He said, you somehow, you somehow have to make people's lives better. Somehow. <laughs> it was simple. I liked it. And I'm like, I get emails every day, friends. And I don't like talking about it, but it's the facts. It, it happens. I get emails daily of people just saying, thank you. Just thank you for, for having the channel here. Thanks for this community. Thanks for the people I've met. All this stuff comes in daily. Why do you think I keep coming here? It sure ain't to say, hey, look at me cut a tree down. <laughs> it sure ain't for that reason. I cut trees down because that's what I do. I'm not here to say, look at me cut a tree down. I've said that for six years, five and six years. That's not the gist of this channel. If you get to pick up uh, uh, some skills on, on filing your power saw and cutting trees, well, that's a bonus. That's a bonus. Nick Pixel. Be the light, friends. Nick Pixel says, be the light. Nick is the light. Now, who's this guy? Oh, my goodness. P Rig, Rig Piggy, buddy. I, I probably missed a bunch of you. Buddy, I can't believe you. You are a guiding light. Keep doing what you do. Hope you are in the right place. Be kind. Oh, my goodness. Rig Piggy, buddy. Thank you so much. You're such a support today. Thank you. Holy cow. Wow, Rig Piggy. Thank you, buddy. Don't hide your light under a bushel. You got that right, snowman. Joe Wag, square file is saw with my video. Oh, I'm not a real square filer, but if something helped you, that's good. That's good, but I don't I don't do a lot of square filing. I got grinders for that. Although I do know how now, and I'm glad I've learned. And I'm I'm not I, I got a long way to go to do that. The reason I wanted to learn is so that I could clean up my chains in the bush, which is a good thing. Hey, who's Chris Hughes? Hey Buckin. <sighs> wanted to let you know you're one hell of a person and that with you telling your accident story, you really helped me. Not take my life for granted because I was a uh, miserable for a long time. Well, Chris Hughes, that's that's good that you thought that way. Very good that you thought that way. Thank you for supporting the channel, pal. I appreciate it, big time. What a man, thanks for the super chat, Chris.
Guess what? Here's the deal. You guys gotta, you guys gotta give me just a second. I hope you enjoyed the little drumathon. I sure did. Give me one sec. Give me one second. So friends, I, uh, sorry friends, sorry about that. I, uh, oh. say now oh my sander so friends that handle I made well for starters okay I went to the lumber yard it wasn't the lumber yard it's a place called the finishing store, okay? And I, whoa. Hey, wait a minute. Oh, you know what we gotta do? Friends, I almost forgot. There. I got us plugged in. Now, if I miss some stuff, friends, have I? I have, haven't I? I'm sorry. If I've missed something, I, I, I don't do it on purpose, friends. So, I went and bought a board. It was nine feet long, hickory. It was nine feet long by, I guess it was about 10 inches by inch and a half. Well, this right here, okay? And I freaking cut it into into flats like this. I cut it into, into blanks, right like that, friends, okay? And I used my bandsaw And I created this. And then I broke it. But that's okay. I think we're actually going to be all right. It's already, it's glued. I did this close to an hour ago. I'm going to leave it a little bit longer. Okay. But the deal is, the deal is, check this out. I want to show you guys something. I also... I saw this board there, friends. It was white oak. You need to see this. Oh, goodness gracious. Look at this, friends. Look at. White oak, freaking beautiful. Now, so <clears throat> this is the this has been the template for the uh, for the wood bullet. I love this, mind you. This is hard to get. You got to leave it square till you haft your axe and then cut it off, right? 
Well, I don't know why that busted. It just did. I hit it wrong knowing me. So I've been making my own handles, friends. Yes, indeed I have. Right? So what I've been doing, quite Frank Stankly, I'll show you. Not with this vice, mind you, but I'm just gonna show you anyway. Right? I've been doing this. I'm way too high up in the air. It's probably not gonna work. Right? Heartwood in this one. I'm not worried about it.
Okay, so it takes time. You get a workout, but I always start up at the top. And it doesn't take long to get onto this. You just gotta get, get in there, dig in. Take it off, take a look, right? I don't use this vice very often, friends, at all. This will give you an idea, just a few minutes. See? You just get right in there. But you'll notice sometimes the wood, it, it, it pulls, it'll pull big shanks out, friends, right? You know what I'm talking about, right? If you've ever tried this. This is starting to look freaking good. Oh yeah, see this is starting to look deadly. I don't wanna stop, but you guys don't wanna sit here and watch me do this, do ya? You do? Really? Well, well, I'll tell you what we're gonna do then, because that is not the right place to do this at all, friends, at all. Now, I wonder if I've got, let's see. Well, you know what I could do? I could go old school on you, go like this. Freaking throw this sucker. This is why I like having my my stuff set up like this. See this? This comes over here now. Goes like freaking that. Now I can plug the light in for you guys. See? Yeah. All these cords and everything. Yeah, see we can plug you in. Boom. You're in. Now, here's the deal. Why don't, why don't we go like this? I got to get you guys a spot. I know you're all over the place. Just bear with me. Don't lose your, don't lose your cranium. Don't lose your cranium. Let me see if I can get you guys in the right spot. I don't know if I can just yet. I'm going to try. I might even put you guys up here. You know what I mean? 
No, I got to put you guys over here. Hang on, just bear with me. You got to bear with me. Um, okay. No wonder. I think I'm on to something, friends. How's that? Does that actually work? Is this, friends, does this work? Oh, well, there you are. You're right freaking there. Oh, boom! Ho, ho, ho! Hey! I like this. That wasn't so bad, was it, friends? There. That wasn't too bad, was it? Come on. Are you guys close enough? See, I can work on this this thing like crazy. I, I need a heck yeah if everything's set up. Are you guys okay? Is it bright enough? Everything's good? friends hey I wonder if you guys could actually I just 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 hang on a second I think I'm thinking something here now it just might be me I, I'm not sure it just might be me just a second where is that Right here, friends. I'm not playing around. Talk to me about that. Come on. I think that's better. Hey. Casterman. Who will help me with a hoodie for Bruce Manley? I'll help. Casterman, I'll help. Let's let's send uh and we're actually looking for another size too for for both of them. Let's let's Casterman, good idea. I'll help. Let's send Bruce one. Bruce, would he extra large? Robin, what size is Bruce? Casterman, good man. Oh my goodness, Matthew Runge. I can't believe this. Matthew. 
I just seen a, a, a super chat by Matthew. Now, Mr. Matthew. You're crazy, Matthew. Thank you, buddy. These super chats, I'll tell you, it to keep up to them is difficult. I need you guys to help me. Look at look at Matthew. Oh my! And there's Paul again for the ma for the manly manly hoodie. Oh yeah, I will too. Bucking. Check out the other super chats. Oh, I know, I know. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. You guys, gals, women, and children. Oh my god! What? Oh, it's freaking Craigular. Hey, Craigular, buddy, listen. I know that you're not doing this for any other reason than because you love me, buddy. I know that. But listen, pal. I need to know sizes of, of you and, and your dad. Was that your dad with you that day? We got Owen something. But I, I want I want to send you I want to send you a hoodie, Craigular. I do. Could you please email Christine at buckandbillyray.com? You you're amazing, buddy. You you've you've helped this this place out in the last little while like crazy. And, and we appreciate it like you don't know. I know you do. I know you do. Craigular, thank you so much. Um I, I want to get you guys a hoodie. We're gonna put a package together for you. I am beyond blessed, and the blessings are only a matter if they are shared. It's it's freaking riggy, rig piggy again. <laughs> you guys, you don't know. I, rig piggy. Well, he's done it. To, what's it? Riggy, that's. All you super chatters, friends. I. Ashley. Bruce Manley, kindness and politeness are not overrated at all. They are underused. Robin and Bruce, I love you guys. Robin and Bruce were out on their property yesterday, friends, working their faces off right in the wood with the power saws. Robin sent me a picture. They were just giving her. Robin and Bruce, I love you. Thank you, guys. Matthew Runge, I don't know what to say. I... Casterman, Paul, Maka. Oh, I can't believe this. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. oh no. I will help with the hoodie. Riggy, Rig Piggy. Oh, I don't know. Jarrett, hey, Bucking. I posted my first axe hang to buck an experience. I want your opinion before I wedge her home. Wedge her home. Oh, you haven't you haven't put a wedge in it yet? I'll go take a look after the live. But I'm not that good at giving advice. Jarrett, thank you for the super chat. Friends. I, I'm I'm a little bit taken back right now. I uh, I, I it's so friends I. I do all my work with, with this thing. And then once I get, see how sharp that is? It's just taking little teeny bits. See that? On an angle. Okay. I like to 
This is where I like to start always at the head, friends, okay? This is looking really good if you look at it. Look at it, friends. You can make your adjustments at any time. See that? I don't even draw lines, friends. I do sometimes. I do sometimes. I'll draw a line. It's a good idea to get out a pencil. Where's my little pencil? There's a pen. It's a good idea to draw a line like this. Right down the middle or grab another blank. Put your blank in here like this. Come up the middle. Like this. Right? Come right up. Boom. Okay, that's a good idea to do too. It gives you a point of reference. But when I'm doing this, friends, I like to... Whoa. Pilk Polk, how are you? William DeBerry, Snowman. Jarrett, thanks again, buddy. Uh, all you super chatters, honestly, from, from my heart, from this channel, from everybody, thank you all so much. I don't know what to say sometimes. You all are so generous, and we appreciate the heck out of you. We just do. Thank you all so much. Wow. Tom Doyle, how many axes do you make a year? I don't know. I honestly don't know. I could probably figure it out, but I've made about... I'm up over 700, I think, now, since I started. So if you think about that, I've been making them for about four years. Five, maybe. Yeah, lots. Super chats are great. <laughs> Stephen Gwynn. Stephen, love you, brother. Rick James, I would love Buckingstock to happen. I don't know if it's going to, but I sure would like it to. We, it's looking pretty good. Our, our lady, our lady has said some things. Uh, our, our woman who's in charge of, there's been some good stuff. Jamie Bark and Spider, I dropped a tree. In the right direction. Bucking many thanks. Ha! <laughs> good man, Market Spider. You're a good man. Okay. I want to talk about this, friends. Have yourself a regular size axe head with you when you're doing this. Take a look from time to time what you need once you get here. Friends, we are so close. Friends, I've wanted to do this for a long, long time. You know that, right? Like make my own. Friends, you don't have to do it this way. You can get out your sanders and you can you can do whatever you want to do.
There it is. Okay, we're on. Okay, so now what you do, friends, just get it on, right? Get it on there. Go like this. And then take a look down the axe. Hey, Buck, and check your Super Chats, and how does the Still 500 compare to the McCulloch compare to the, compare to the, compare to the, compare to the, wow, hang on a sec, let's read this, but what I got to do, because I can't see nothing right now, uh, the 500, the 500's a strong saw, um, that's brand new technology. So uh, the 500 strong. It's a, it's a nice saw. Uh, it'll be nice to see what happens when we get a muffler on it uh, and try and enhance some of its natural givings. Uh, yeah. It it I uh, the ported 371s and 372s are. You know, I mean, it's a 79cc saw, right? It's a lovely saw if you're a still guy. If you're any kind of guy, it's 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 a good power saw. It's a, it's a great power saw. I just like the feel of the Huskies feel stronger in my hands. You know what I mean? Like the, they were built stronger. And, and, and... All the mechanics I talk to, it, it just, the Huskies, the, the, I guess they're just put together in a different fashion. And uh, I can feel it in my hands. That, that's where I feel it in my hands. I've always been a Husky guy. Uh, yet the still 462 and the 461, I would take a 461 over the 500 any day. Any day. Uh, the 461 is one of their best saws ever, in my opinion. And I don't know a lot about still. But I do know that the 461 is a great saw. Great saw. Ported or not, it's a good saw. What dogs do you have on your 372 looks like West Coast saw four points in silver? No. No, those were a gift from a friend. Yeah. Yeah, he, he uh, that was a gift. Those are custom. Custom dogs, yeah. Yeah. So, there we go, friends. And every time we do this, every time we go through this process, you're going to bust a couple eggs, friends. You're just going to. You're going to bust a couple eggs. But but we're in there. Like, we're in, in there, in there. Like, like you, you won't see in there, probably. You know what I mean? Like, it's in there. Look at it. Look at that. Deadly. And straight up and down, if I might add. It is. It's deadly square. I love this stuff. It takes way more time, but there's so much more integrity in it, right? Yeah. I got an idea. I'm going to let that dry a little longer. We're going to see something. We're going to see. We're going to check something out, friends. Don't, don't get your tails in a knot just yet. But I got to do something. Did, did we get all those all those hoodies looked after for the one for the Manleys? Craigular, I want you to email Christine. Christine at buckandbillyray.com. Christine's my right hand. Nick Pixel's my left hand. Mac is my right leg and decal's my left and <laughs> we're a team. Team Buckin. Without these people, I'd be freaking still working in that in that carport out there. Straight goods, I would be. Without decal and all the people that take part in this channel, I'd be still in that carport right now. Who knows what would what would be? I don't know. Dirt Road Landing, I love you, brother. Healed Heart, Thunder Junkie. 
the Spark and Spider. Thunder Junkie. Thanks, Thunder Junkie. Is that G-Man? Oh, no, it's C4 Ranch Fork. C4. Late to the show, but wanted to do my part. Buck on, brother. Hey, C4, thank you, pal. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Excuse me. Daffle Lark. Daffle Lark. Mike Moran. Mike Moran. Love the hard work and love. Hey, Mike, what else is there? What are you going to do, Mike? Mike, brother, I'm talking to you. Mike Moran. What are, you, what are we going to do? We're, we're men. What, what, what do you, you got to, right? You got to feel and you're, you got to live, right? We have to live with ourselves. Hard work and love. That's a lovely little concoction right there, isn't it? I like it. As a man, I, I, I was so afraid when I got hit by that tree, friends. I was so afraid that it was over for me. I'm half the man I was physically. Maybe, maybe half the man. I was, I was a force, friends. Uh, you see what I do now? Could you imagine if I didn't have a? I'm all, sh I'm all, I'm pieces back here, friends. I'm all pieces. My hips are freaking tweaked. I, I can't even sit with one leg. Like I, I'm all twisted up. <laughs> but I can still freaking do it. And I will do it for as long as God's going to be willing to let me to work, work and help people love. How hard is that for the world to do? It's not. We can do it here. We can take the high road wherever we go. We got 275,000 people here now. Hey, um, Manley's, um, Robin, Robin Manley, I'd like to speak to you. Are you on please? Robin and Bruce, are you guys watching? Travis Stewart, how are you? Jorge, Jorge Costa. Jorge, good country. Good country living. Crispy Freeman. Crispy, love you, brother. Uh, Mrs. Manley. Mrs. Robin Manley. That went by fast. Wow. Vincent. Holy cow. There she is right there. Now, Robin, have you noticed that my demeanor has been a little more relaxed today? Come on, give it to me straight. Just say yes or no. If you have, you have. If you haven't, you haven't. I slip into my old behavior sometimes. A little crazy. Right? I'm trying to be a little more relaxed. I was wondering if you noticed. <laughs> Later, Craigular. Craigular's taken off. Craigular, you're a savage, brother. Craigular, you are. Craigular, did we? We haven't hooked up yet, have we? Did we hook up, Craigular? I don't think I seen your email. Did we chat, Craigular? Talk to me, brother. Well, I got your email now because you've emailed Christine. I want your freaking phone number in my phone, buddy. Ha ha, you are. Craigular, I want you in my phone. You got WhatsApp? Not sure you got it. I don't know, buddy. Hey, email Christine again. BuckinBillyRay.com. Hey, George, did we send your axe? Hor George, did we send your axe? I forget. Have we sent it yet? Did I give you a, 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 a tracking number, buddy? I forget. Honestly, I do. Because if I haven't, I'm going to put you back on the chalkboard. I don't know, he says. Well, that means you haven't got a, a tracking number. So let's get this square. I don't want to I don't want to leave that anymore. I thought we had... I didn't show an axe, though, did I?
There. I'm starting to get smart, friends. I wouldn't have mailed anything in the last week anyways. It's been crazy. Um, now George, we did, did, did I have a style that last live feed? Remember when we gave you your ax? Remember? Did I have a style? Did I show an ax or did I just say, we're getting your ax to you? Do you remember? Who remembers? I don't think I showed a style. There's George right there. George, remember when I said I was giving you your ax? I didn't, um, I didn't show a style, did I, buddy? No, you didn't. Okay, good. Good. Thank you. No eager beaver, MR. No eager beaver. No, sir. Thanks, George. Okay, I got you, buddy. I got your back. I got your back, buddy. See you, Mike. Yeah, Miles has got his axe. Miles got his axe, friends. He lost his mind. He sent me a video. He's got his axe. I think it's on his channel or something. Whoa! Who's that? Paul! Pilk Pokes, M O K. Shirt, Pilt Paul. Oh, nice, nice. So, are we sending Pilt Paul a messengers of kindness shirt? Uh oh, Rig Piggy. Oh my goodness. Be kind. I would like to thank Buckin's family and friends who dedicate themselves to provide us with Buckin. I believe the greatest gift anyone can give is their time. You know, Ray Piggy, you're absolutely right, and I agree with you 100%. Listen, buddy, you've been a freaking star today, buddy. Uh, all BS aside, friend, I mean, come on, buddy. That is amazing. You, you've been amazing today. Thank you so much. This blows my mind. You did it again, friends. Ray Piggy did it again. Country living's de getting down. Help on some shipping for Pickpalk's shirt. Pickpalk, you better send Christine your information again. Christine at buckandbillyray.com. Do you know, I think I may have sent George's axe out. George, I think I may have sent your axe. I, I'm not joking you. I think I did. I'll have to check. This is the best gift in the world. For once it is given, you can never get it back. Pat F, right on, brother. You inspire a lot of people. Stephen Dotty. Stephen, thank you, buddy. Thank you so much, pal. No, I know, George, you wouldn't have. It, I may have a tracking number for you. I'm not sure. But if not, this week... We'll get it out. It's going out. It's happening. You know, friends, this one man thing with all this stuff on the go, I never complain about it because it's my own choice to do some all this stuff. I don't complain, but I will tell you, if I don't write stuff down, I'm done for. I'm, I'm absolutely done for. I'll have all intentions to mail axes and, and do all that, and then trees call. I get called to cut trees. What do you think I'm going to do? I'm going to go cut trees. And everybody that buys an axe, everybody that buys an axe, you know what they say to me? Take your time. They do. They say, take your time. Thank you for that. Thank you. <laughs> I won't, George.
The boys are upstairs giving her. <laughs> Sean from Souk, you uh, need a visit. <laughs> You're an island healer. Oh, right on, buddy. Good to see you. Good to see you and suck. Life happens, no doubt. Nick Pixel. Thanks, George. Thanks, buddy. I, I appreciate it. I do, buddy. I appreciate it. Thank you. But I'm getting it out. It's it's happening. Don't don't you worry one bit. I'm getting it out. Yeah. Oh yeah, he was he was freaking. So, don't you think it's pretty cool, friends, that you can take an, a piece of wood like that and turn it into this over here? I, I love it. I, I think it's incredible. I've only done so many, right? But now that we got it like this, I, I got a fit now, right? So, I do have my sander too, friends, right? I do. I have my sander and I do use it when I get down. But this is what I do now. This is what I do. I just keep, I'll do half the handle now, friends. You gotta be careful, you'll pop that right up. That sleeve will come right up. Sometimes upside down is the way to go. See that? That'll run right away, you gotta watch it. See? You, you, it'll tear right up there, you'll be so angry, friends. They, they do that. You've got to watch it. That's why sometimes the sander helps. See? See that? Yeah, I don't, that scares me sometimes. Too, friends is you can get basically you can flip it around too sometimes that works better but you'll watch now <clears throat> this side tends to work better it should anyway Yeah, it does. See how that works? That side works great.
So that worked better. Wow. I think I'm actually going to grab while I'm here. I'm going to grab some of this here. You guys rattling around? Okay, so. So I just, it's just keep going. Just keep going. Sometimes now I'll switch to here, you see, halfway. See? I go like this. I put that there. Where's my axe? I go like this. I put this on here like this. You see that, friends? Like this. I could have done it before. It don't matter. It's got to get done either way. I want to show you guys something that I was quite happy about. Let's put this like this. Make sure you've got it all in there. So that's boom, that's right on the money, right there. Okay, that looks good. This looks good. Very good, we're in. Okay. Where's my favorite little pencil? I just had it. Okay, well, I guess. Huh. I use a pen. Okay, that's it. Did it work? That's why I like my pencil. There it is right there. Let's redo this. See that? So now I go to the bandsaw. Are we going to the bandsaw? You guys want to go to the bandsaw? I'm just not even going to ask you. 
We're just going to the bandsaw. That's all we're doing. Uh-oh. Did I wreck it? You know what I could do? I think I will do. Is this. Yeah. This is what I'll do. I'll stick you guys right here. I want to show you what I do here. Because it's wonderful. And it speeds up the process when you've got... You know, when you want to make handles. See, the nice thing about this too, friends, is I'm actually getting a sweat on. This is wonderful and glorious. Okay. You see this? Watch what I'm going to do. Watch this. I'm not very good at this yet. I don't even know if this is a good spot for you guys. I want to show you what I do here. Just bear with me, friends, for a minute, because you might be able to use this trick, and I'm all about sharing stuff, because life is that, sharing and caring. Okay, here we go. You're going to be able to see it. Now, are you guys still with me? Okay, watch what I do. That's not good.
Okay, I don't know how long that was. It wasn't that long. But this is what happens now. You guys got to go back in your home is what happens. Back in your home. Let's make sure you're okay. I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings. Right? How's that? Everybody okay? Okay. Good. Now, gotta stoke the fire. Ow. That's hot, apparently. All right. Key to the bush. It is hickory, yeah.
Okay. So this I'm not a, I'm not a professional at this, friends. I just do what I do, how I know. I'll probably morph. I'll probably morph along the way and get better. At least I can say that the guy's making his own handles. I love it. See, we're on, we gotta watch this one. We're on the peel now. So now what I do, when I get it to this stage, friends, like, like when I get it to like that, you see what I mean? It's almost ready for sanding, friends. And I get out my sander and I, I start sanding. Seriously, that's, that's just what I do. I'm, I'm not the best, uh, and the fastest draw knifer in town. You, you've got to be careful. You can ruin a handle in short order. That's why a lot of guys go to the sander right away. Yeah, see, I'm, I'm afraid to grab a hold of stuff because it'll peel. So, a guy can literally get out the sander at any time, right? Remember, one, one way pulls better than the other. Okay, so that's starting to look real good actually. And you get a sweat on, which I like. Yeah. Okay, we're almost ready for that sander. If you guys want to see that, we'll do that too. Guys will just get right on the sander right now just to deal with this. You can, but you don't have to. You've just got to be careful, friends, because you can gouge your wood like so fast. Like that. You gotta be careful. Very careful. A 
freaking sweating, friends. <laughs> See, you can tell on that side it wants to peel out, you see. Okay. Whew. Look, there's the freaking axe handle right there. It's almost there. It's almost there. Like, literally, it feels like an axe handle. So now, now, I'll show you what I did yesterday. I was playing around in here, and I... I took the sander to that handle and the whole room filled up with freaking sawdust and it's not good. It's not good at all, okay? This has got heartwood in it, right down the middle too. <laughs> oh, well, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. It's a good test, good test. Okay, now, show you what we're gonna do. Well, we're not gonna take it to the finished product, but I'm just gonna give you an idea of what goes on now. Um, what do I need to do here? You guys. Yeah. So I'll show you what I did, friends. See this here? Okay, you guys come come out again. I wonder how much jam you guys got left in you. This is what I do.
got my little hook right there. Boom!
You know, friends, I never used to wear any of this stuff. But now I do. You guys still on? Good. Okay. Excuse me. Now. All right, so friends, I don't know how long it was. I don't care how long it was because what happens is you end up, I'm not, I'm not done. As you know, I'm not done, but you end up with this, like we got, we got a lot of work to do here yet. You can see it needs to be sanded, but I just wanted to get back in. I could sand out there and get all finicky, but that's no fun for you guys, is it? No, it's not. It's no fun for you guys. That wouldn't be fair. So. Now. Look at me. <laughs> okay. So I'm excited as heck about this. Completely excited about it. Right? Oh, one thing. Okay, so that is so cool. So now you just do your little thing here. This is how I broke the axe, friends. Yes, indeed it is. And I know how I did it. I didn't, uh, I didn't chamfer the edges, friends. You gotta chamfer like this. Make them round because you'll hit a corner and it'll drive the force straight down the where you want it to go straight down the heart. But anyway, I mean, we're not there yet, but look at that, friends. Tazzies are funny, they sit forward, eh, you know that? <laughs> this thing's sweet, so I'll bring a little off of here. It's gonna be nice. Now.
Yeah. Good to see y'all. Dad, you're here. Just getting rid of the dowel. There you go. Okay. This will be interesting, friends.
going to be interesting. Solid. I'm going to make the apps. It's a shame I broke it, but I can't go crunching along there no more. Look how much wood came off of that. <laughs> Look at that. Wow. Friends, look at that. You need to see it. You know what I mean? It's straight. See the dowel? That glue is that glue is amazing, friends. It it is amazing. I just smacked it again with a hammer and it hasn't done anything. So I mean it's down. We got curl everywhere. No. I say. I say we put a wedge in it. Right there. Sycamore. That's it. Two thirds down the axe, friends. Right there. That's what you want.
Can you guys hear the wind out there? Hey? I think that's gonna stretch pretty good. I like it. I like it, I like it a rock. Let's see. That's tough, boy. I think it's a fix myself. I, I just think it's a fix. You, uh, you people are amazing. Who the heck is that? Oh my gosh. Friends, is that Don? Don? Is that Don Clayton? Did he pop in and... Don... Thank you, Don Clayton, for your super chat. <laughs> what a freaking guy, man, Don. Okay. Let's do this. Hey, see you, Trav. Good to see you, buddy.
Okay, we got one more touch. See this? See the difference? Friends, check this out. Check out the repair. It's at the top. See it? This glue that I'm using, friends, it's it's absolutely crazy. Like I spilt some on here, it's nuts. It's just, oh my goodness. Okay, now let's do something. Let's go like this because we can. We're those kinds of people and I think we can do it. But there. We did this last week too, remember? But I happen to have 
I happen to have. Check this out. And why I do have these is because Hey, what happened? Oh, I thought you guys went haywire on me. Hey, Jarrett, your dreams are coming true. You see that wood right there? That freaking wood, do you know what that is? It's called Arbutus, and it is absolutely freaking gnarly. El Gnarlio. It's kind of a shame because this is, this is beautiful, look at this. Looks like a little pocket right there, friends, see that? We use these as like, uh, Look at this stuff, friends. Can you can you see it? Look at how hard that is, friends. <laughs> This thing's crazy. Hang on, friends. I'm trying to figure this sucker out. Oh, okay. I see, friends, sorry. <laughs> there.
think it's going to be fine. <laughs> I've done this. I've done this fix a few times, friends. And it works. This is a wicked axe. Tazzy. Freaking Tazzy. You guys got stuff on you. Well, I'll tell you something, friends. There's nothing. I know I'm all over. I know. I get it. But that's the price you pay for action. You can't have it all. There. Okay, well, what do you guys think? That's a lot of work that goes into those axes when you make your own handles, friends. So if, if you're buying an ax off of some guy and he makes his own handles and halves his own, makes his own axes, it's an art, it takes time, um, and I'm not very good at making handles yet. I'm not, friends. I'm going to get way better because I quite enjoy it. I enjoy the fact that there's something here now. There's something that came from, from these things. Not just bought at the store, but you can buy some amazing handles like Killinger's handles. I mean, that stove was ripping. I'm just saying, uh, for me... Did you see how I kept that on there, friends, until I finished it to get that finished look? I love that look. I love this. So I, I wait till the end and I cut that off so that I can haft it. Make sense? Oh, friends. <laughs> oh, dear. I mean, I'm just... It's, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. So I bought a whole bunch of these. Kevin, you're welcome. You're welcome, Kev. Yeah, you're welcome, buddy. You're welcome. I want to thank Michael Donnelly didn't know about the Buck and Army on Facebook application pending. There you go. Yeah, it's a good group of people. I, I, I didn't join it myself. They tell me you got to be kind and there's no debating. It's just love, all love and all supporting one another and lifting each other up in their life events and, and talking power saws and axes and, and there's no there's no debate. There's nothing up for debate. It's just, it's just love. <laughs> so yeah, I didn't fit in. <laughs> Don Clayton, you're a savage beast. All you freaking subscribe, uh, 
Tia, subscribers and, and super chatters. I can't believe it. Thank you all. It's crazy. <clears throat> Excuse me. Right on, Ian. That's good to hear, buddy. Thank you. <laughs> well, hopefully I'll fit in. Thank you for sharing your time. Yeah, Robin and Bruce, uh, did we figure out? You're welcome, Robin and Bruce. Uh, did we get a, a hoodie for Bruce Manley? And Robin, I'm working on, I'm still working on that for you. I'm just going to go, I'm going to outsource it and, and just get it printed. That's what I'm going to do. I got Christine on it. The Art of Craftsman. You're welcome, buddy. Good to see you here. What did you think of the old half Deroni? <laughs> Pretty barbaric, but I like to do them live once in a while. I like to show folks that just, you know, a draw knife and a little sander for your finish up. I mean, what the heck? That trick with the bandsaw, that is such a, a help. Taking out all that wood, you know. Yeah, nice to see you here. You're welcome, Robin. <clears throat> Steve Letts, Buck and I got this weird axe like shaped package in the mail yesterday. Cool. Right on. Cool, Stevie. Yeah, yeah, it works good, buddy. Thank you. Justin Blanchette, I've learned so much from your channel. Hey, right on, buddy, good, good. Uh, Vibergs are expensive. They're pretty much the same, I think, uh, all across the board. Uh, I was down at the shop there. Uh, I was down in Viberg last week. And it takes a little bit to get a set of boots, probably six months or so. But um, I think they're the, they're the same. Uh, 600 bucks or something. Six, seven, something like that. But I'll tell you something that's interesting is JK, you know, JK reached out and made those boots for me, friends. You remember that? Well, I, I, <clears throat> the, the boots themselves, like the fit was, was great. The fit was excellent. He nailed the fit. Uh, I just, it was the style of, of the, the big, I just, I'm trying to be nice, but I just, I just didn't, it's hard, to, it's hard to even put words to. I like the boots, but not on my feet if that makes sense, because they're beautiful boots. But just, I looked down at my feet and tripping and flipping on those big platforms and it just didn't work out for me. So you know what? You know what that freaking guy did? He he texted me, oh, I think yesterday. And uh, he said, Buckin, it's it's JK. What's happening with the boots? Are you, are you wearing them? Or is there something I can do? You know, and I thought to myself, well... I'm just gonna be honest. I, I said no. I, I, I'm I'm not I'm not wearing them. I, I'll be honest. I, I, I thank you. They're lovely, but I'm just I'm just not wearing them. They're not me. Uh, but thank you. And he goes, well, no. He says that's 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 not good. What 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 can I do? He says to me, what can I do? I want to make you another pair. You know what I'm saying, friends? Smart guy. So they're gonna make me a pair that that can work with my spurs. And, and they don't have this big, you know, that big platform thing. I, I didn't, I couldn't wear them. So he's going to make me another freaking pair. Pretty crazy. Nice guy. Yeah, Pilk Pulk. He's going to make another pair for me. I, I, I didn't like the first ones. I liked them, but I, not on my feet, if that makes sense. It's called customer service. You're exactly right, Jason Slade. That's what he and his. I'll bet you his dad instilled that in him. 
Yeah, they're a family-owned business. They care. And it meant something to him that I, that I wasn't wearing the boots. It meant something to him. So he's going to fix it. Talk about a good guy, right? Yes. <laughs> Dallas Blair, yeah. Well, I usually start shaking around 50 feet, not 20. <laughs> So tell me, tell me what you guys think. Do you think that's going to stand up? You know what I'm talking about, right? There was a crack from here. It went from here to about right there, right up there. Just a crack. Boom. You think that fix is going to hold up? Give me a heck yeah or a heck no. You just seen what I did to it, right? That's hard, solid, solid wood. Who thinks it's going to stand up? I don't know why it wouldn't. I doubled it, friends. Doubled. I hope so. I hope so. Cool. Well, good. Yeah, I'm, I'm not a carpenter. I just know that every time I've done one of those dowel fixes, it's never broken. Good. Good, good, good. I like to hear that. Excellent. Heck yeah. Oh, Stevie Letts thinks it's going to work. That's a good thing. Who's the carpenters out there? Do you guys, you carpenters think this is going to work? Nick Pixel does. Yeah, I've heard that too, Nick. And this is inst instant. This is uh, not instant. It's interesting. It's Elmer's and it has kind of a texture to it, Nick. Do you know what I'm saying? It's not just like wood glue. It's wood glue, yes. But... I, I, you know who, hey, the art of craftsmen, are, uh, are you still here? The art of craftsmen, are you, are you still here? Joe Wag, how are you doing? I wonder if, I, I think he's a woodworker kind of fella. I wonder if he thinks that'll hold up. Oh yeah, there he is. Hey, do you think that fix will hold up, buddy? That 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 dowel, you know what I'm talking about? Right through. I, I put dowel, glue, glued the crack and dowel, five dowels right through center. Do you think that'll stand up, buddy? Do you think it'll hold on? I do. The wood will give before the glue, Mr. J. Daniels. Yeah, I'm hoping so. There's the casterman. What does he say? Stronger than wood. Oh, okay, good. Probably longer than the rest of the handle. I see what you mean. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I think it's going to be good. I. It feel it's got that sound. Do you know what I mean? Like there's no like rattle or anything. It's like that sound, you know? It's solid. We should go beat it up some more, eh? On that Arbutus. Maybe chop up the rest of it. <laughs> I love axes. I love swinging axes and chopping wood. I like it. I like chopping, chopping wood. Yeah. I got a sweat on today. I like it.
Oh, I feel like I've been going for about 20 hours. Let's mellow out here for a minute and get grounded. Let's get grounded. Things are a little crazy here. Let's settle down. I tell you right now, friends, I, I, uh, I, I really enjoy making these, these axes, eh? I, I do. I really enjoy it. Uh, I've really evolved. My craft has evolved. Um, the handle, uh, the handle is, is so much a part of, of, of the ax. Like friends, uh, the, the handle design, where is it? Okay, there is a piece of metal in there. I wondered about that. I had a piece of metal in my hand yesterday. And uh, I tried to dig it out. Oh, I think I might have it here now. It didn't come yesterday. Oh, there's another one. Shucks. <laughs> Oh, well, it's some little shavings. Now, what was I talking about? Oh, yeah. Where is it? Right here. Okay, so here's another one that I made out of bamboo. Right there. This is the handle. This is the style. Okay. You see? It's our, it's, it's a handmade style. It's, a, it's from, uh, Basically from, from England, my buddy who sent me these, AJ Axe and Saw. You know AJ? He, he sent me this. He cut it out uh, very rough. I think I've got one here. Yes, I do, as a matter of fact. Yeah, here's one right here. Okay. I've already worked a bunch on it, but this is what he sent. Yeah, see, I've done quite a bit already. But he sends me them square like that, but with a little more cut out. And I turn them into this. And I'll tell you something, friends. You see, I, I just, I like this style. It's, it's a beautiful style. So that's what I'm going with for the, uh, for this, for that sucker right there. Here, show you. For that son of a gun right there. Look at that sucker. The freaking wood bullet. The bucking special wood bullet. Friends, we're making this thing. We're going to do it. Jonah made eight. That's as far as he made it. We tried our best. He, he, he's moved on. We've decided to, as you all know, he's a great, nice young man. He's doing his thing. Uh, so I've decided to do this. And with your support so far, it's helping so much. So thank you all. We're buying a press, all the tools that are needed to do this thing. And we're doing it up at my old fallen partner's house, Brian's place in the barn. And it's going to be amazing. So that's the plan. And, uh, but... This handle, friends, this handle is, it's, it's crazy is what it is. It's absolutely crazy. <laughs> it's the best axe I've ever swung. I swear to, I swear to God, it is the, it's the best splitting axe I've ever swung in my life. Hands down. I got no reason to tell you freaking stories. It's the best. Bear Claw freaking loves it. I had to scratch mine off him the other day. I got it back here. I'll show you. It's 
It's right here. Okay, sounds good. Thanks, buddy. I'll be in. Okay, where is it? I, I got to show you this, friends. Just hang tough. Oh, I think... Where is it? Oh, I think this is it. Yeah, this is it. This is it right here. Th this is it. This is... The, oh, as a matter of fact, do you guys want to see something nuts? You want to see something a little crazy? Hang on. I think I can get that out of me. Hang on. I got to get this out of me. What's this? I think I got it. Oh, I think I got it. Okay. This is the one. This is the original one. So I give it to Bear Claw, okay? Get this. I give it to Bear Claw. This is actually... This is, hang on. It's 03. It's 03. <laughs> so Bear Claw gets it and he does this because he's actually right. I don't know if you'll see it. See what he did? Yeah, oh one. <laughs> He's a sneaky guy. You guys know who I'm talking about. Just come outside with me. Come outside with me. You, you need to see something. And friends, I got to go. That was my boy telling me I got tacos. I'm going to say goodbye to you right now. I freaking love you people. All of you, every single one of you that come here. Okay, I love you all. Super chatters. I, I don't even have the words for that stuff. I thank you all so much. Thank you for coming here and supporting my my whole my whole belief system and my life and, and what we're doing here and, and supporting the trees going down and all that stuff and the cutting and everything. Um, moderators, I love you all. You, you're so helpful here. Auction Indiana, if you're in the house, I love you, brother. I'm going to go smack that last piece of Arbutus and I got tacos in the house. Friends, I'm going to sign off by beating up that piece of Arbutus out there. I freaking love yous all. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> let's just do this. This will be easier. We got tacos, but I want to show you something. Check this out. This is the best axe I've ever swung in my entire life. Hands down without a freaking doubt. Not even, just forget about it type thing. Check this thing out. That's our beautus. It's gnarly, friends. You saw that Tazzy go at it. It was fine. It did fine. Watch. I'm just going to try and take it right down the middle, okay? I'm excited, actually. Of course, of course. Look at that, okay. So that's gnarly hard. I just sunk it, check this out. 
One pop, you're out. See that wood? Done. See it jump out? This wood's crazy. Look at that. See it jump right out? This thing's crazy. That's the best axe I've ever slung in my life. Did you see it jump out of the wood, friends? It don't get stuck. See that? Another thing I like about it. This axe is crazy. Friends, I love you all. I gotta go in for food. I don't wanna make Mrs. Bucket angry. Love you all. Get outside. Get the heart pumping, fellas. Come on. 40, 50, 60, 70 year old men, we gotta keep the heart pumping. We got to do it. The longer we sit, the harder it's gonna to be to get rolling. Let's do it. Over and out, friends. Be kind to one another. Over and out.